Hello, my name's Ian Marsh and I want to share something very special with you. Uh, I want to speak to you about my latest book, The Inconvenient Truth About Business Success. But before I do talk to you about this and the benefits of all well, the information that I've put in here and how I'd like you to have a copy for free, I want to talk to you about the genesis of why it was born, why I actually wrote it. See, I'm guessing you're a business owner, maybe you've got a small or medium sized business and you're wanting to improve the results that you want to get in that organisation. Well, I too am a business owner and I've been in business for a very long time. But for 17 years, I struggled to get ahead. In fact, I was lucky to make $50,000 gross uh, as an electrical contractor. In fact, I was reminiscing the other day about my life back then and looking at some of the old photos, you know. Uh, for example, here's a, my fridge and there was nothing left in it. Believe me, it was a struggle from week to week for me to keep myself even fed. And then the, the mansion I lived in, check this out. This was me living in Binya Street in, in um, Pendle Hill many, many years ago. Uh, no, 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 not that mansion, not that mansion at the front. Uh, the little chook shed towards the back. Um, that is the place that I lived. In fact, I shared it with two other people for many, many years, just trying to make ends meet. Just to give you a bit of an idea, oh, and here's my amazing contractor van. That brings a smile to my face. You know, the amount of times I got pulled over by police because of smoke pouring out of the back of that vehicle, because it wasn't running on all four cylinders, it just uh, was quite, quite interesting. Oh, I used to park it down the road because there used to be a massive oil leak in front of whoever I parked the car in front of their property. But speaking to that, the reason why I share that with you is because I struggled for so many years trying to get ahead because I wanted to really provide the lifestyle for my family. Like, you know, just the things that just about every person wants to provide for their family. Send your children to the right schools and have a nice car to be able to drive and live in a beautiful home that you can call your own. You know, nothing spectacularly fancy, just pretty much what any normal individual probably would aspire to. But for 17 years, I didn't know how to crack that code. I didn't know what I was doing wrong. I thought it must be because of your connections and I thought it must be because of you know, people you knew and this was my lot in life. I refer to it as a story. This is the story. I figured, well, I've tried my best. I guess I've got to get used to it. I don't deserve any better than this. How wrong I was, ladies and gentlemen. See, so many of us, in fact, all of us create a story. Now, whether it's a success story or a mediocre story or a failure story, we build these stories up in our minds because of the surroundings that we are in, because of the people that we associate with, because of the environments that we are in. And what I want to speak to you about and the reason why I created this book is I want to help you create a new story. See, you may be looking for the latest, greatest tactic or trick to help you succeed in business. I'm here to tell you that even though there are many in here, things like how you can get an instant three to 500% improvement in the leads that you are generating in your business with no extra effort or expense or things like how you can build a top gun team to be able to give them tasks to do and then have them carried out the way you expect them to be. You're going to get all of that from here but more than that you're going to understand a different way of thinking. You're going to learn how to become more street smart in business rather than sheep smart. And ladies and gentlemen once you actually become street smart in business and start applying the principles of success to your organization then the world just changes. You know, within, <laughs> looking back on it, when I did start learning these principles, within a year I was doing a million dollars in turnover. And remember, I was only doing 50,000 before that. And then that kept growing. Within three years, I mean, the life that I had, this is the sort of vehicles that I was driving and the home that I lived in and the transformation just three years later by understanding a different way of doing business. And then now, I mean, I'm speaking to you from my home. Uh, I'm lucky enough to live in the home that I desired and, and uh, go, go where I want pretty much and do what I want because I've created a business and not a job because I get to have and enjoy life on my terms. And I'm telling you now, the story that you have in your mind, whatever it is, it can change to become the one that you want to have. So if you want to have the home of your dreams, well, you can have it. If you want to have a business that largely runs without you, you can do it. If you want to go on holidays wherever you want to go, you can get it. However, you have to start looking at some inconvenient truths and then applying them into your life and into your business. Now, if any of that ap appeals to you and you do want to start to get dramatic improvements, and I'm not talking just small improvements, I'm talking probably more money in a month than you've normally generated all year. Well, then get a copy of my book. 
you know, I want you to have it if you're a serious entrepreneur and I'm willing to foot the bill. If you just cover postage and handling for me and put your details below, what we will do is we'll rush this out to you and you're going to start to learn those principles that I applied and there's every chance that you're going to start to get the results that I get. And because success models success. And when you see what someone that's successful is doing and you do the same thing, obviously you start to get the same results, which is exactly what I did many, many years ago. So again, ladies and gentlemen, get a copy of my book. If you do not love the book, if you do not get a massive value from it, let me know, I'll refund you your postage and handling. But I do wanna see you get the benefit from this and shortcut your journey so you don't have to wait 17 years to start to enjoy the life that you want. Uh, just on a side note, I want you to have a listen to James and Alex and listen to their journey how within a very short period of time they went from being a struggling horse importer and distributor to being one of the fastest growing horse float distributors and sales organisations in Australia. Uh, how? Well because again they applied the inconvenient principles that I'm sharing here and when they did, they started getting more money in a month than they used to get all year. No exaggeration, and they're not the only ones. There's many other, if you have a look on our YouTube channel, you see many, many examples of the same thing. We had a, a, quite a bit of beginner's luck in the beginning, I think, and it was probably because Alex is so well connected in the horse world with all sorts of different uh, dressage divas. And so they saw her beautiful new float and how many great things it was doing for her horse, her horse which was a really bad traveller up until that time. Um, so we got a lot of sales uh, from those people who were immediate family and friends and, and, and referrals and recommendations. But after a period of probably around about six months, that flattened out substantially. And I felt that we, at that stage we needed something and, and James had been um, too a seminar with Mel a couple of years ago and had mentioned the Shopanor and I'd, I'd seen seen one from a pool company and I think at that point that was the tipping point that really resonated that we needed to get into this thing and get the Shopanor done. So a, a, about at the same time that, that we got our first run print run of the Shopanor, we um, our website became live as well um, and uh, almost overnight I saw um, a massive increase in the number of um, phone calls I was receiving, emails I was receiving um, and because we have so many videos on our website and we've got the downloadable um, version of the Shop and All plus a, a hard copy, when people were, were calling me they were speaking to me as though they already knew me and so I'd already online or had already developed a, a huge amount of trust. Um, so our, our sales initially um, spiked quite significantly because I think we dealt with that trust issue which was the, the big elephant in the room with imported floats that we were having a problem with. So middle of last year we had sold maybe 10 floats in six months um, but July the shop and all became live, um, we had hard copies of that, we, our, our website became live and then in, in the last six months of last year we sold about 24 floats um, so we doubled our sales um, in six months and this year we're on, we've, we've doubled again, so we've, we've quadrupled our sales since um, last July. Well, did you enjoy their story? I still get a buzz when I hear about it, but uh, look, bottom line is, they decided to write a new story. They decided to stop just spinning their wheels, being very busy but not accomplishing much, and getting real traction. And I really enjoyed helping them achieve that. In fact, look, again, get a copy of this book and when you start reading it, you're going to start to resonate with some of the principles that they've just shared with you. And uh, I might leave you with another friend of mine, a gentleman called John Dwyer, who was in massive, massive financial difficulties, actually. And uh, when he started to learn these principles, these inconvenient truths, uh, again, his whole world changed and, in fact, let him tell you his story. But again, put your details in there, get a copy of the book, and, and I'm sure in some way, shape or form, hopefully we'll meet one day in the future. Bye for now. I uh, was in a real dark place. Uh, several years ago, um, I was uh, $3 million in debt with a uh, construction business. This is a family business. At that time, um, uh, I'd actually even become homeless because of the, uh, um, the, the debts and the, um, the court cases, and etc. that were uh, uh, besetting upon it. At the time, all I could do, because I was uh, 
I was so broke, I could think of was um, to do this painting. So um, I grabbed together some painting things and started into it. And then uh, Anne showed me uh, the strategies on how to uh, do the marketing and sales. Now, the thing you've got to understand is I thought that that was the end of it. Um, it wasn't the end of it. It just happened again and again and again and again. And last Thursday, $18,000 in my pocket. I started winning using Earn's marketing and, and sales strategy. I, um, I increased my conversion uh, for every three quotes that I was doing, I'd win one. So um, that's still the case right now. And I'm now, as a result, I've got my, I, honestly, I, where's my wallet? The only reason I haven't got more $100 notes in my wallet now is, there it is, the only reason, you can't fit any more in, into my wallet. For every dollar I've paid them, uh, $15 I've got back. So I've handed them, for $1, I've got $15 back and I'm multiplying that even more now uh, just applying these strategies. It works and the money will appear into your life. Thanks guys.